Hey guys, this is Dilip and you are watching <coughs> my video. In this video, I am going to tell you how to install and configure the PSP WM Tiling Window Manager. PSP WM Tiling is a window manager that tiles the window. Uh, the window like this for utilizing the entire screen. This also helps to focus on our work and get our work done. So let's install the tiling window. <coughs> so I am using a Debian based distro. I gonna use apt install so PSPWM and HKD HKD what? KD1 yeah yeah BSPWM is very minimal window manager so we need to install hot X hotkey simple X hotkey demon hmm, will help the BSPWM for grabbing the key bindings with BSPWM and the hotkey demon we will need also need to install polybar. Polybar is to, so please is my password. As I already installed, I have them pre-installed. So it's <coughs> showing this. They are so before. Let open the. My, my window for we first log in into a base wm window manager we have to do some things or take care of some things before the first is configuring the base wm this is a i am using default base wm config pulled from the github so this is is like it. The most of the stops here are descent as a default, but but when we but we want to the polybar to start automatically when we log in into a, to the login into a BSP WM. So we we gonna do like polypath just this. this is auto start polybar and here the name of the path we want to install start and this much for this be WM for the moment. The next we gonna configure is hot key table, which is here. the default key bindings for the BSP WM are very decent and logical. But we need to take care of something like we need to make configure it like a super return that is window plus enter key will launch the terminal. You can set it set it your favorite terminal but mine is urxvt only so i keep keeping it as it is and this is program launcher program launcher okay let's change it to oops let's change it that mine is d but it's enter yeah, is Rofi show. Yeah, I am using Rofi for as a program launcher. You can use DWM also. So T run. So for the moment, these are the changes we need. And yeah, super escape that is window escape will help you load, reloads the hotkey demon. The most of the stops aren't important for a moment so this is done now this another program we need to focus on is polybar so this is a so 
this is default config of polybar one thing i like about polybar is that it works out of the box with bsp wm and i3 wm or i3 caps polybar has a built in a pre built bsp wm and bsp bsp wm wm module and i3 module which is here this one yeah this one so let's sort let's log out and log in log back using bsp wm so when i have logged back into a bsp wm this is how bsp wm looks by default a just a black screen screen and this is polybar which works out of the box with bsp wm and i3 i know so we don't want our to see a black screen whole the time so let's change our wallpaper So this is Rufi. As I told earlier, to that I have seen that I change the key binding from D menu to Rufi. So let's start our nitrogen. So this is a a wallpaper setting program. Nice graphical program. So these are tons of them. No, wallpapers for the moment let's access and apply so, this. so still not good i know so let's install another program called pycom it is a compositor let me zoom it apt install pycom it is a compositor that will let us basically gives a nice gra effects visual effects as i already used to have is have it installed so it's showing this so let's do floating yes super s will make the window floating so you can use them press super key and then use a mouse to move it around mm -hmm. Let's install Pycom and enter. Yeah, as you can see now, even gave a nice transparency to the terminal. And here the bar is now feels like it floats, which basically it isn't yet. Yeah, Pycom also gives a nice. Just cancel it. You don't. Pycom experiment. Tell backends and run it in background. So with this, it will give a nice blur effect for the terminal. I know blur takes my system resources so let's cancel this it for the moment I could cancel yes this so this is PSPWM out of the box here you can use a program called not this make it zoom again called danced for your notice as a you for your notifications as i already have it or is running no i just launched it 
so like notification notification send come title This give us a notification here. We can configure it. It also has a Here is a configuration file. This is a configuration file. Yes, box. So, I know my desktop seems slow because damn, I am running a damn potato machine with Pentium. Yeah, terrible. 21st century and I am using Pentium. Here is a running a simple screen recorder taking the resources. So, uh, you can configure it the way you like, like I did. Not this one, okay. I have my own config files. I just used downloaded some default configs for the programs like bspwm polybar and as hot simple hot x hot kitty man you can download it the uh, config files and yeah main point just a second rangers and storage And put put the config file in a dot config directory. Great if it does not have obviously it won't have a directory bspwm. Then create it and the inside that directory create a bspwm rc file and copy the content of the default config from the web from the links that I will provide you in the description to this file. Well, I don't it's pretty extensible window manager and probably the my favorite yeah i tried my xmonad qtile dwm i haven't figured out it yet xmonad probably in future so this is for today guys hope you like it share subscribe the channel and share the video and give a like if you like the video and if you don't like then give a dislike and I would like your comments here are your comments in the description box and yeah these are the config file all the only from, from the github default configs when here is hot running yeah, it is. So, thank you guys for watching my videos. Support me. Goodbye. Goodbye.